Hello friends, welcome to my channel. It is almost four to six months I was unable to post the video regularly, but hereafter you can find a lot of videos which I have created based on the recent experience of farming and gardening. In today's video, we are going to talk about something related to farming. I'm going to share my experience about plantation of various fruiting trees and the product which I am, have used first time. Well, that product is more related to agricultural uh, plantation and then I'm, I have tried that product based on someone who is already mastering on that. He has did recent past almost 1000 plus plantation by using that product and he has found that the results are very good. So request you to kindly watch the video till last. Well, the month of June, July, August was pretty hot in this part of uh, India and I was waited for rain to start. The good is that the rain has started even though this part of India comes late but then it started and it's the right season for farming. So what I have did is that allowed the rain to you know uh, happen for a few more days and then started digging the hole uh, on the ground by uh, maintaining the equal distance almost 8 to 10 feet distance between two plants that's the thumb rule and well if you could have you know mix the mixture like compost and any other uh, you know substance or product with the soil and fill the soil uh, in, in the hole that will be good but then I have not did it because I see uh, it's raining so allowed the you know uh, the holes to be get filled with the water so that the water can get uh, uh, absorbed to the further down that's that's the thing well just to pause on the topic and talk about gooseberry as you can see the gooseberries have just started taking shape the good part of these gooseberries are they are so natural that even i have not given the water so whatever the rain water comes it all grows because of that and even a neem oil uh, a spray i have not did so it's very natural and good you know harvest it it gives as you can see the you know just taking a shape now and trees will be full of this well come back to the first topic so this is something you know uh, the delivery of the plant in the night hats off to the nursery owner his family who came at 7 30 delivered it in a, my farmhouse even though it's a pretty dark rain was there lights are not there and this is the product the agricultural gypsum is about I, I am talking about so well the thumb rule we follow the same thing uh, we use the 2 kg of compost and a gypsum and little fungicide little name cake powder and mix the soil very well well the benefit of gypsum as i was mentioning and this something is suggested by uh, a person who has been doing very professionally plantation as i said that recently he did thousand plus plantation in one of the farm of mango farm and there he has used this the benefit which he was mentioning and uh, is that one it helps the you know soil to absorb the water very well second thing is that you know it is a it, it's kind of excellent source of sulfur which is very much needed for the growth, growth of the plant and third thing is that you know it, it basically cuts down the phosphorus movement and which improves the quality of various fruits and vegetables fourth very important thing is that it basically changes the pH value of the soil and can promote the better root growth. So if your soil is very acidic, then probably you need to you know uh, be watchful before using this. Otherwise, this is an excellent product based on his recommendation. I also did some sorts of you know uh, reading about that, googling it, and then found it. Yes, few parts people are already using this and they they finding it very good. So good source in terms of if you if the soil is very hard of your farm then i think this is the best thing which you should mix with the soil and not much just 2 kg of this if you mix with the soil and again it depends like coconut where you have a bigger you know a hole which you created uh, there maybe you need to use little extra like for coconut i used uh, whole size was 3 by 3 so there i have used almost 3 kg others are 2 by 2 there i have used 2 kg of it well, the rate was around 200 rupees per 50 kg bag, which I purchased from the shop directly. You may get it on subsidized rate by government authorized, uh, you know, uh, shops. So I have not tried that. Well, 
and just to you know give you a, uh, about this plant this is a bay leaf plant we call locally uh, a biryani leaf plant the best part which i liked about this plant is when i crushed the leaf the aroma was awesome so just wanted to share with you well the one thing very important any plantation you do irrespective of any season must pour the water to the plant that's something very important so this was my all experience on plantation this time i have shared with you previously also those plants are growing well and try this with gypsum this time let's see how things moves so all this is about farming l as i mentioned that in coming videos you can see lot more about gardening and few updates on farming too so that's all uh, for you and uh, as you can see the gooseberries uh, it just you know the branches are bending down awesome product look forward that you know uh, this grows further and here are the night blooming jasmine good outcome i have already posted the video about this this is something which is grown on the ground and you can see it is blooming very nice so thank you for watching this video hope you have liked it uh, you have liked the natural beauty all around that for that kindly give a thumbs up if you liked it and look forward for you subscribing my channel thank you thanks once again